Hi guys, Raj Sanga of Cardi Security. Welcome back to the channel. Today we have another car and coffee meet. Today's event's been organized by Clive of Mercedes Benz Club, and we have 70 odd cars here, loads of classic cars and loads of new cars and lots of stuff in between. So we'll show you some of the cars in the car park, as we always do, and we'll grab a couple of people and let them talk about the journey of the Mercedes that they own. So you know what, let's have a walk around first. Lovely pagoda over there. Let's have a look at this pagoda. Look at that. That is stunning. Fortunately, it has started to rain. We are in the UK, so obviously we can't control the weather. When he did rock up this morning, and he was one of the early ones here, Hood was down, he was enjoying it, but obviously it started to rain. Actually, the sun's coming out, so maybe we'll get an opportunity to get the, uh, the owner take the hood down and show the interior. Beautiful car. Let's carry on walking this way. W124, lovely colour. What do you guys think of this colour? Unusual, not many cars out there in this colour. And obviously, uh, Harry's R129. He's already been on the channel. There's a link below. You can uh, watch the episode where we interviewed Harry about his car. And he didn't buy this car like this. Everything you see here, he has modified wheels and so on. But you know what? Watch that episode and you learn what he's done with this car. Another Pagoda, R107. You get the drift. There's a lot of classic Mercedes in the car park today. Actually guys, what do you think of this? Old school Merc, bag Benz, diesel swapped. Would you do that? Guys, we've actually opened up the workshop today, uh, parked a few cars in here. Just look at this amazing S500, which we bagged recently. It looks amazing. Check this out, old Mercedes phone. And we've made this custom pod and mounted the airlift control in there. Looks amazing, proper retro school installation there. Blap on SQR46 tab. Obviously the go-to stereo when you've got a classic Merc. And let's just show you our Merc as well. This is one of the Slam Sanctuary projects. It's now currently being bagged, it's in the workshop. We managed to get a slot in our own workshop. Jay's actually fitting the suspension. There'll be an episode dropping on the channel very soon covering the airlift performance installation on this. If you come over this way, have a look at the wheels. Freshly built up by Voodoo Motorsport. Again, these will be featured on the episode. Make sure you come back and watch that episode. Ray? How do you Raj? Good, thanks for coming. Now, apparently, these are the same cars, but a little different, is that correct? Uh, that's correct. The base is exactly the same. We started with that and we made it look like this. So this is a 500 SEC? That's the 500 SEC, uh, and this is a 500 SEC wide body. So this didn't leave the factory like this, it left the factory like that? No, it left like that. Uh, and you and put this kit on there? That's correct. So this is a Mercedes kit, is it an official kit or? Um, it is a replica of AMG. Okay. And this is what the AMG wide body looked like. Was it originally this color? Uh, no. Okay, so, so it's had a color change as well. You put the kit on. Yep. Airlift 3H. Yeah, that's correct. And the wheels, I mean, what are these wheels? They're humongous on the back. Um, they're AMG Aero 3s. Okay. But they've been built up custom uh, into 18 inch. Uh, we're about 11 and a half on the back. Yeah, that is ten, seriously wide. 10 and a half on the front. Now, when you pulled in, this does sound meaty. Is this a stock engine? Uh, engine is stock, but the, we've got custom stainless uh, headers, full stainless exhaust, um, and that's why you've got that rumble that you... I think we're probably going to have to get him to just start it so you can hear it. That's naughty, that's naughty. Proper ASBO that is. Wow. Very impressive, very impressive. You don't see many of these on the road. And if you do, you'll probably get out of the way. Because I definitely would. Staying with 
with classics, we've got this gorgeous W108 250 SEC 1967. Obviously slammed on airlift management. This belongs to Leroy. Leroy, How come doing? closer. How, How are you doing? doing? Yeah, good, thanks. Thanks for coming. That's all right. Wow, what a car, what a stance. Now, talk to me, there's no way that you bought this car like this. No, I didn't, no. You, what have you done to this car? Uh, so everything, full restoration. So it was originally white? Originally this, this color, yeah. Okay. So it's gone back the same color. So all the bottoms of the doors have been cut out. Because these are renowned for rust and yeah, all sorts really of stuff. Yeah, they're really bad, yeah. So all the doors, the seals, floor pan, both of the front was cut sure. out and redone. A um, couple of other little bits on the chassis legs. Okay. But nothing too, nothing too dramatic. And obviously airlift? Airlift, yeah. Manamo again? Yeah, yeah, airlift, uh, yeah. Custom rotor form wheels? Custom rotor form wheels, yeah. Okay. Quite quite wide at the back, do you know the other? Yeah, ten and a half on the rear. Ten and a half on the rear, yeah, okay. Yeah, ten and a half on the rear, eighteens, and then eight and a half on the front. Let's look at this interior. Is. That is beautiful. Obviously, you've done that, haven't you? You've yeah, had that yeah. Done? so a friend of mine in Bournemouth did all this. He trims boats usually, but he redid all the that interior for me. Stunning, guys. Uh, again, man of my heart, Rockford Fosgate speakers. He's got some coaxials on the, uh, in the kick panels. Got some coaxial, in fact, components on the rear deck. Um, Alpine head unit, nice little uh, controller mount built in on the, underneath the stereo. Now, engine. I know there's something very special yeah. there. Come so on, let's have a look. Engine 606, super turbo. Can you tell me why have you put a diesel engine in this car? So Dan from Bagbands UK, good okay. mate of mine. He's got one. We were going to go petrol uh, twin turbo. V8. V8, yeah. But after having to go in his and reliability, sure. torque, power. So do you know how much power torque you have It's here? about 530 bhp and about 900 newton meters of torque. That's a shit load of power. Yeah, so for what it is, yeah, it's all right. <laughs> That's a shit load of power, guys. Um, let's start it up. Let's hear, let's hear it. Yeah, all right. Did he just say 500 bhp? That's crazy, guys. Let, let's let's uh, tap the gas a little. Oh, wow. Yeah. It certainly sounds like it's got some serious power. Leroy, thank you for bringing Pleasure. this down. What Not an insane build. Love cars like this. You know, he started as life as a stock Merc, and what he's done to it is absolutely amazing. Credit to him. His details are down below. Make sure you tap that link and give him a follow. One thing that's really caught my eye, original Blaupen stereo tape deck working as well with the separate controller for the radio and the volume. Now, this in itself is a rare find. These are worth a fortune now. You know what, this is proper retro chic coolness here. Wow, look, lovely seats. 6.9 V8, crazy. Guys, check out this W210 slammed on the floor. But you know what? What do you think of this number plate? A little rude? I don't know. Would you rock around in that number plate? I reckon I could until my mum saw it and probably get a slap. Another limited edition car, Brabus SL. Apparently one of five. Just look at that engine. 1969 280 SEC. Looks amazing. Check this one out, W124 320 Thor, as it says on the number plate. Starts here, carries on going, carries on going, carries on going, carries on going. Finishes here. That's a big car. He needs a big garage for this, doesn't he? There's Clive, Clive. So Clive, well done for organizing this event. What a great turnout. I know the weather was hit and miss this morning, but yeah. you know what? I've got to say to you, credit to you, mate. You've got all these cars here together and a nice genre of classics and new and bagged and OEM, yeah, yeah. OEM plus. So talk to me about the Mercedes-Benz Club. What's all that about? Okay, right. Mercedes-Benz Club has been around for about 70 years now. You'll get different cars from all particular eras, right? 
from really cool classics, right, that, that I kept stock, to my car, which I decided to bag. Um, and I've got to say, and you've, you guys have done a yeah. fantastic thank job, you, I've got to you. say. Thank you, What a um, cool car it I've is. I've got to say. Um, so, I urge you to number one, uh, join the club, because it's just, it's just fantastic, right? I, I'm just the, the face of it today. Um, also, follow Spiky Curve, I'm not gonna, I'm not. Those details are on the right. screen now, yeah. tap that, Boom. give them a follow. And I, I know what I'm gonna, I'm gonna tell you a little bit about my car. I'm gonna be a bit, be a bit selfish, right? Just for once. It's nice to give to somebody. He's, he's lying there, guys, because he's always selfish. But this on, car. Carry on, carry on. This car, 280 CE W114 Coupe, in a very rare colour, moss green. Uh, standard, apart from the stealth install um, um, these guys done. They did a fantastic job. You can see it's, it's literally on the floor, uh, which is exactly what I wanted. Very, very, very little negative camber. Um, drives beautifully. As regards, the best in the business. Guys, can I have your attention, please? Okay, so we got a little giveaway. Guys actually sponsor our YouTube channel now. Um, Dale has picked his favourite car of the show. I think you've gone for Leroy's 250SE. Leroy's got an insane white 280SE out front. It's actually on airlift performance. It's got a full, full boot build, audio install, and it's actually diesel swap too. Pretty cool car, I think, right? Really cool build, man. Appreciate it. Guys, as always, um, I'll do the outro now. Uh, any questions you have, any comments you have, drop them down below. We'll do our best to answer them. You know, which cars did you like? There's a good mix of cars there. Classic, old school, new school, bagged, not bagged. What did you like? As always, share, share this video. Uh, subscribe to the channel. There's an array of events coming up in the summer months. Tap that link on the website and you'll be able to find out when the next events are and what the next events are. Now guys, I'll be back in another car and coffee event. See you soon.